I like to do things that haven't necessarily d been done before. I like people to come out of the cinema or after having watched the DVD and said, wow, that's unique. I've not seen that before. That went further or in a different direction or felt different in some sort of way to anything that's that, that I've witnessed before. So uh, the beauty of this film is I think in spades that you will come out of this movie and say, wow, I have never seen De Niro do anything like that before. I've never seen Jack Efron do anything even vaguely in that wheelhouse before. So the idea is to not shock gratuitously, but um, not take that middle ground, not compromise, not do things that seem familiar in any sense. Dick is unbelievably played by Robert De Niro, who does things in this movie that I never in my wildest dreams imagined he would do. And he has been the most game, the most willing, the most on board participant you could ever imagine. There are such things in this script that I read on paper, I thought, well, yeah, okay, obviously they're in the script, but is Robert De Niro really going to do that? And not only has he done that, he's taken it further and bigger and funnier and better than you could ever possibly imagine or comprehend. Zac Efron plays Jason and again I was incredibly excited about working with him having seen him in Neighbours in particular in which he delivers a brilliant comic performance and I have to say I was a admirer beforehand but I am now exponentially more impressed with his abilities as an actor and as a comedian, his versatility, his depth, his authenticity are, are frankly incredible. And he's got a very difficult job because a lot of the laughs on paper go to De Niro's character, go to Dick, but he plays the straight man with such incredible ease and skill and keeps it fresh and makes it funny and has created this incredible character that's even better than what was on the page. He's, he, you know, he's really impressed me in an, in an unbelievable way. Not only is Aubrey not intimidated, I think she's seen it as a personal challenge to be as outrageous, as forward, as uncompromising as humanly possible with, uh, with Bob, Dick, uh, Mr. De Niro, uh, and uh, on a daily basis just sees how far she can push it and her scenes with her. And it's just so ludicrously brave and fearless in what she does with him that um, I can't imagine anybody else doing it. And again, she's made it something that, that far exceeds what I ever imagined on the page. I think when you see the film, you will see a movie that is more outrageous and extreme than you could possibly imagine given that it stars Zac Efron and Robert De Niro, but underneath that fundamentally has a real heart and a real message uh, and some real soulfulness that, that, that feels authentic hand in hand with this kind of edgy humour. Hey, so did you like that video? Now, I've got an interesting fact for you. Did you know that The Dark Knight made more money in its first six days in the US than Batman Begins made in its entire domestic run? Hmm. Now for this and more movie facts, click on more videos or click on the playlist for more trailers.